sometimes there's more going on than meets the eye. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 5 details you missed in 13 Reasons Why Season 2. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. We're looking at the little things most viewers probably didn't catch on their first viewing of the new season. Number 5. Alex's Joy Division Poster Happy birthday! 13 Reasons Why deals heavily with the subject matter of suicide, and the series' multiple references to 70s new wave band Joy Division continue this. Alex Standall, who dealt with his own suicide attempt at the end of Season 1, has a poster for the band on his wall. Joy Division vocalist Ian Curtis tragically ended his own life, reflecting Alex's own harrowing experience. Can I play your tape? Yeah, of course. The band's song Love Will Tear Us Apart played in the opening episode of the show in Season 1, while Tony was giving Clay a ride home. Everything was better before. After Curtis's death, the band reformed under the name New Order, who are the artists behind another song that can be heard in the Season 2 premiere. Number 4. The Day of the School Dance The school dance that ends Season 2 took place on April 20th. This day is remembered as the anniversary of the Columbine school shooting, one of the earliest and deadliest school shootings, becoming widely publicized in America in 1999. The date is chillingly appropriate given Tyler's actions. Tyler, what are you, what are you doing? April 20th is also significant as a day of student walkout protest across America in reaction to gun violence in 2018. You need to leave right now. Whether you think the show's use of this important date is a fitting tribute or if they took it too far, there's no denying the show's precise use of symbolism. Tyler, listen to me. You don't get out of this alive, and I don't want you to die. Number three, the photo on Hannah's locker. Look, the whole point is to capture you as who you are. Okay? Yeah, okay, cool. In the first episode of Season 2, Tyler testifies in the trial against the school. During his testimony, we see in flashbacks some of his interactions with Hannah before her death, including a photo shoot done in a park. You're, you're really amazing. Thank you for, for doing this. Oh my God. Thank you for asking. The details of the setting are reminiscent of the picture of Hannah we first saw at the very beginning of the show in Season 1, taped to the makeshift memorial on Hannah's locker. Small details such as this truly add to the depth of the show, giving the world and events a stronger sense of realism. Number 2. Sid and Nancy Back in Season 1, Justin and Jessica attended the school's costume contest dressed as infamous punk rockers Sid Vicious and Nancy Spungen. In Season 2, in his postcard to Jessica, Justin addresses Jessica as Nancy and signs himself as Sid. Vicious was the basis of groundbreaking punk band The Sex Pistols, and he and Nancy had a rocky relationship that ended in both of their deaths. The pair were, like Justin, addicted to heroin, and Nancy was found stabbed to death in their hotel room. Vicious was arrested for her murder, but he was released and overdosed before he could be tried. Hopefully, Jessica and Justin's story has a better ending. Number 1. Blue Nail Polish Throughout much of Season 2, Clay receives Polaroids from an anonymous source, along with cryptic notes about the extent of Bryce's crimes. One picture never tells the whole story. These notes are written in a distinctive blue nail polish, the exact same shade as the polish used by Hannah to label her tapes before her suicide. Since it was eventually revealed that Zack was the one leaving the messages for Clay, we can't help but wonder if the nail polish was a subtle nod from the creators of the series or a conscious decision by Zack, who was another person close enough to Hannah to know the significance of the color. You already have three of these. There's the rest. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.